out. So, for the ruffle scarf, I failed to tell people how to start it. So, I will start it. And this is... I'm going to cast on only eight. So, I make my slip knot. Remember how to do it. Around. Pass it through. So, that's my slip knot. And I will cast on eight stitches. This is how the beginning for the ruffle. This is the ruffle yarn. Remember we did that? We made a scarf. So we are going to cast on eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. I will make a little knot there, just a simple knot so it doesn't go anywhere. So there, done. So I'm going to knit eight. So one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, and come back with the eight. Knitting. Everything is knitted. No pearls here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Of course, uh, you, know, you can do whatever amount you want. You can make 10, you can make 15. I have one very, very big one that has the 15, but anyway. So now we start with our ruffle yarn. We go into the first one. And here I made a knot at the edge. Very, very tight knot. And I'll cut that later. So, I will go into the first one. So, we're going to spread it. See how it shows? Let me get that out of the way. So, I go into the first little space there and knit it. I will go in there. This is the next one. Go in there and knit it. I'm going to find my next one. I'm going to skip one. You always skip one and then knit the second one, the next one. So this is the one that I knitted. I'll skip that one and I'll knit with that one. Two and skip one and that's the one that I knit with. I'll find the next one there and go and knit with this one. Find the next one and Knit with that one, find the next one, knit with that, and skip one and find the next one. Skip one and find the next one. Skip one and find the next one. So now I'm going to return, and all this is on the video where I teach you how to make this card, but I want to say it again always always put in the front the yarn that you just knitted so I will do that as soon as I get there but this is so important so and find the next one and find the next one go in there find the next one Go in there, find the next one. Go in there and find it. So this is very important. The yarn that you just knitted with has to be in the front. So and the next one that you're going to be using has to be in the back. Always, 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 no matter what yarn you're using, the one that you just finished knitting with is going to go in the front and the next one is in the back. This is the one that I'm going to be knitting with. 
So that goes in the back and it's the same thing. So let's do this once more because it doesn't matter which one you're using at the moment. So we're going that way for eight stitches. Turn. Come back. So this is this is something that I thought about because it's uh, it gives you much volume on your scarf. Okay, so remember that the one you just knitted with has to be in the front, and the one that you're going to be knitting with next has to be in the back. So this is the one that I just knitted in the front. This is the next one that I'm going to be using. It's in the back. 